saw pictures of it recently. <laughs> I know you know how to do it. You're a master videographer. Now why are you telling me? <laughs> So remember how I told you about our Dollar Tree challenge? Well, Scott put my presents up. I, I want to see what's in them. Nope. <laughs> Let's see. Let's see. Ooh, what is this? <laughs> it's I was looking at yours. I was looking at yours. I want to get you. <laughs> ah, got him. I just want him to come out here. <laughs> Bought two new chairs from Goodwill for our Christmas dinner today. Good morning! It's a beautiful day. Scott made me a delicious smoothie for breakfast. And now I am about to leave for work. Whew, I'm out of breath. Um, yesterday we had presents from our family and it was so wonderful to have everyone over to our place for um, dinner. It was the first time I think we'd actually all eaten here for dinner, which was really nice. And we're looking forward to when we have a house so we can have more space. But it actually worked out really well. We had enough space. Um, so yeah, we had so much fun. And now, um, we have a couple more days with all the siblings. Stephanie leaves on Wednesday. Kim leaves on Friday. And Steve's here till 20th, which is pretty cool. So, um, Scott is gonna hang out with them today. He took off work again today. So, that's gonna be good. Dot is over here using his phone, hey, his uh, handset oh. that mom got for him. Uh, what are you doing? What are you doing? Hey, hey, are you going to, um, are you going to desk? Oh, so long. I'm gonna dip with you all night long.
morning y'all I just scraped my windows and it's still frosty even on the inside uh, I gotta get to work I'm a little late we're having our holiday party today so I have my Christmas sweater ready my handy snowman sweater for my grandmama and I gotta stop by um, the store real quick to get some gift bags bye wow I did such a good job look at that good job Bill Hello, so I just got home from work. We actually had a holiday party today. I've been pretty sad lately or just since yesterday because of all the crazy stuff that's been happening in the world. Another guy was killed in um, Charlotte, Tim Davis. Oh, and uh, we got this calendar at work by this photographer named Sharon Chang. She's a local photographer in Seattle. And she had a um, Black Lives Matter calendar. And she had pictures from um, different protests and things that happened throughout the year this past year. And so then on the days, instead of holidays, well, instead of like nationally recognized holidays or federal holidays, in addition to um, the holidays that were related to you know, African American history and things like that. She also had, um, she actually had on there, you know, the Standing Rock victory. And she had, uh, like, Harriet Tubman Day. I didn't know that Harriet Tubman Day was in March. Um, like, she had the day that Malcolm X was killed. She had the day that, um, Civil Rights Act. She had a bunch of different historical events that happened. And she, a lot were personal about, you know, when people were killed or when they were born and things like that. Then at the bottom of the calendar, she had listed per month with a person's name and the date they were killed. Oh my gosh. And I don't remember what month it was, but the month that Sandra Bland died, it was like over 30 names of people who were killed that month by police. So it was just a lot. You know, it's a lot to... to be reminded every day someone has been killed in the past people are getting killed on a daily basis and um the system allows allows them to get away with it so it's just a lot i'm just thinking about i was reading a lot after trump was elected recently and how people say, you know, we need to organize. We need to organize, we need to educate. People need to realize that if we're gonna change what's happening, we're not going to be able to change it within the system that exists because the system was created as a, a way to oppress certain people. And so we're not going to be able to work within the system. We have to work around the system. You know, we have to break down the system in order to um, find justice. Um, yeah, so there's a lot. I don't have any books to recommend. This is a good book. Brian Stevenson. Just Mercy. I think this came out last year. Um, this is a really good book. He's a civil rights lawyer, death row lawyer. But, um, yeah, so it's hard, it's hard, like, to vlog and think, this doesn't even matter, you know. There's so many things that are going on right now in the world. Me showing you my life, what's it, what does it matter? What does it matter, you know, you watching me do my hair in the morning or <sighs> Scott brush his teeth. I don't know. Hello. Thursday. You like my hair? have a house party tonight for work so I am going in a little bit late forgot to tell my boss not good head to work now I really hope and pray it does not snow tonight it's supposed to but take Scott's scarf wish I was like Maddie and could afford Burberry but you know starving artist what can I say Okay, so I'm getting ready to leave. Um, we are going to a house party at this volunteer's house. And it's going to last 
a long time. Just been working all day and watching Living Single. All right, catch up with you later. Bye. On this cold December day, we are on our merry way. Riding along. Hello, it's such a beautiful day. The sun is shining. It is very cold though. It's um right under 30 degrees, so bundled up nice and warm today. It is so beautiful outside. I'm getting ready to drive to work and I don't have anything exciting planned today besides I'm having some food after work with my friend Victoria. So that should be fun. But other than that, I am going to go to work. Um, yeah, it's going to be a great day. I hope your, great, your day has been great as well so far. Bye. <laughs> Not what I was expecting. No.